What's up guys, so we are only a couple days away from the release of NBA 2K22 and we've got some big updates, some big upgrades when it comes to the My Player career and the city. It's been massively expanded, we just got a brand new trailer for it today, it's number one trending on YouTube. It looks sick, let's check it out. You're a remarkable talent, someone with a chance to do something very special in the league. I'm ready. It is my boy. MP, what's up, bro? What's up, man? How you doing, Chris? MP, the new character. You're playing professional basketball. This has to be a dream come true for you. If you do what we know you're capable of, you'll be in that starting lineup. Ooh, there he is. Yeah, you know you're killing it out there, bro. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm here. I have a side mission and stuff. You must be MP. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that map. I cooked up a little something special for you today. Runway show? I got something for you, MP. Book you Racist? Your time to record your first track. Oh, this place is legit. Recording music? Keep this up, and managing all the people trying to get at you is going to be a full time job. <laughs> That must be our boy that handles all of our business. Our friend, our manager. Yo, that was fire, man. Yo, yo this is ridiculous, bro. This is mine. I've got He's had chills, a nice too. little streak, but can he keep it up? They about to go crazy. <laughs> Bro, this, this looks so good. So you guys know, I'm a big NBA 2K fan. We've been playing it here on the channel pretty much every year for like five plus years. Um, you know, I, that being said, I'm, I'm kind of like a little bit more of a casual fan. Like I, I love the, the my player experience and I've done a little bit of park with friends and stuff like that, but I'm, I'm, I'm not a grinder. Coming from somebody who doesn't do that and I know like that, that group of people kind of have some complaints and they're like, hey, we wish 2K would put more emphasis on the gameplay. And, and like the, the functions and, and whatever else. For me, I really love the look of this. Like I, I, I wanna have the experience. You guys know we play all sorts of simulators and stuff like that on this channel. Like I, I wanna feel what it would be like to be coming up and, and you know, be the, the next big thing in basketball and, and you have all these opportunities, you're living in the city, you're moving up, you're getting better apartments, you're, you know, living the lifestyle, you're, you're meeting people, you're recording audio tracks if you want to, you're, you're you know, starting your own clothing brand and, and going to, to um, fashion shows and whatever else. And it looks like that's kind of the, the, the direction that they're moving. They've invested a lot into that. Hopefully on the gameplay side of things for everyone else or investing into that as well. That's something I can't speak to as much on. But uh, this to me looks really, really cool. So we had this trailer and then they also came out with like a courtside report that kind of went into a bit more detail. It's a fairly long article. I'll, I'll link it down in the description for you guys if you guys want to check it out yourselves. But we'll hit the highlights here. So the city's like a, a virtual world. Like the entire My Career story is going to be taking place within the city. You're going to have have, you know your your main storyline quests you're gonna have a host of new side quests and it's no longer gonna be like a, a movie you know a lot of the previous my player career stories were kind of like movie-esque and you were just kind of along for the ride this is gonna give you a lot more input you're gonna have a lot more choices you're gonna be able to choose do you want to go down the path of becoming a recording artist do you want to go down the path of starting a fashion line do you just want to focus on you know the nba do you just want to focus on playing pickup games like you're going to be able to choose and kind of mold your your adventure depending on what you're into which i think is awesome now uh, the story it follows mp we saw him here in this trailer i'm sure you're going to be able to you know customize your character and stuff but yeah that was mp He's a high school star that has a large following on social media and he's known for posting videos of like embarrassing people on social media on the court. So that's kind of cool. You know, I, I like that. Hopefully, hopefully it's done a, a tasteful way and it's not too cringy, you know, social media, YouTube, TikTok star type thing, but uh, who knows? Now he's, he's looking forward to take over basketball, but like we also saw here, there are elements of the music industry as well as fashion and, and you, you can move into that. I don't think you have to. I think you can just focus on basketball if you want but they did mention that some of their favorite moments and cutscenes and, and events in the game take place in these side quests so I mean it's it's gonna be awesome you know you're gonna have all sorts of crazy characters and, and celebrity cameos and stuff like that popping up in these branching storylines which again it's it's kind of the the you know 
the lifestyle of, of a basketball player. You know, they, they say like all NBA players want to be rappers and all rappers want to be NBA players. So you're going to be able to kind of live both lives. They said it's going to be more RPG like. So we've, we've got an NBA role playing game now, which is kind of cool. So you're, you're going to be able to choose who you want to talk to. You're going to have these unique reactions and, and interactions and stuff like that. You're, it's not linear. Like I said, it's, it's not like a movie. So you're going to be able to choose, you know, you're, you're this high school star. How do you want to carve your path to the NBA? Do you want to go to college? Do you want to play pickup games in, in the streets? Do you want to, you know, go to like, you know, G League games and stuff like that? You, you're going to be able to build up your, your draft you know, stock through through interviews. You're going to talk to GMs and, and, you know, agents and the press and fans and all kinds of stuff like that. And everything that you're doing has a role in, in the, the direction that you're going, as well as the opportunities that are available to you. There's this new thing called a personal brand. It's kind of what, what defines you. Are you going to be a big flashy, you know, flamboyant, really out there, you know, kind of controversial player? Are you going to be more of somebody who's just kind of dedicated to the game and, and all you're worried about is playing basketball, you're going to have these different personal brands and, and different kind of branching storylines you're going to be able to take. And of course, on top of all of that, I mean, the, the city itself is a social hub. Like there's going to be so much going on. We've seen that throughout the years with the neighborhood and everything else. But, uh, you know, this year it's going to be bigger and better than ever before. There's going to be more happening. We saw all the, you know, accessories, bikes and, and skateboards and everything like that in here. We saw people throwing a Frisbee around. We saw restaurants. And of course, we're going to have all sorts of shops and, and barber shops and, and apparently according to the courtside report like the the record shop is is he has like a crazy owner that's really fun to talk to and there's there's just all sorts of things happening now everything that you're doing is elevating your your you know kind of like city status they're calling it mvp points and, and when you get to the max level there you're gonna unlock the penthouse so as all of this is happening as you're succeeding in your nba career and your park career and everything else you're also going to be moving up in life. You're going to be getting better real estate. You're going to be getting better access to things. It's just, it, it's again, it's it's literally living the lifestyle of an up and coming NBA star, which is, uh, I think it's going to be really, really cool. I can't wait for it. So uh, yeah, that's kind of the, the, the basic synopsis of it. It was a pretty long article. So if you guys want to check it out, I'll link it down in the description. And uh, that's what we've got going on for the updates to NBA 2K22, my player career this year on next gen now on last gen they aren't going to have all of this they aren't going to have the city they've got the the neighborhood still but they actually have a pretty cool update to the neighborhood that i'm almost a little bit jealous of the neighborhood is now on a cruise ship you heard that right here's some little b-roll footage of around the ship like I'm going to be real with you the city's impressive the city is massive there's a lot going on i'm sure it's going to be very cool but the idea of having a cruise ship dedicated to basketball activities actually sounds like a lot of fun. I almost wish those were flipped. I, I wish last gen would have got the city and, and next gen. Imagine what they could do with a next gen city on a cruise ship or a next gen neighborhood on a cruise ship. That'd be pretty insane. I, I'm trying to go on vacation. So, uh, yeah, that's what we've got going on. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. We are definitely going to be checking this out in a few days when it drops. And uh, I can't wait. It's going to be a lot of fun. I'll see you guys there. Peace out.